Hello, my name is Barrett Booth, and welcome to another episode of Party Farms Outdoors. Well, good morning, and welcome back. Uh, we're back at it, uh, deer hunting again this morning, hosting uh, my brother, uh, Breland, and uh, his son, my nephew, Barrett. You'll remember both of them are uh, frequent visitors to Party Farms Outdoors, and we're hunting uh, today in... Um, Northwest Georgia, back over here in Georgia, and uh, the rut is still uh, happening and hoping to get Barrett um, in a place where he could harvest a nice buck. So anyhow, this will be a, a three-day hunt with him. He's coming in right before Thanksgiving. We'll get some time together. We'll be hunting a little bit in Georgia and also in Alabama, so... I'll be listening out for a shot, and if I hear it, um, we're uh, taking the camera and hauling over there to see what's going on. So, catch back up with you here in just a bit. We've been sitting in the stand now for about an hour and had a nice eight pointer that walked out probably 40 yards in front of us, just kind of cruising through the brush there, hoping that that uh, deer heads over to Barrett's way. We're still listening out for a shot. Just had a doe get behind us. The wind is blowing in our face and our scent's carrying directly to where she was. And she she definitely smelled us and let the woods know <laughs> that we were here, but she cleared out pretty quick. So maybe things will settle back down and we'll have uh, something bigger walk out. All right, we're uh, back hunting this afternoon. Saw some deer this morning, or at least I did. Unfortunately, Barrett and Breland, um, all they saw was some squirrels, but that's okay. You gotta be at the right place at the right time. And tonight we're hunting over in Alabama. Unfortunately, Breland had to go home, but Barrett is still with us. We're gonna hunt tonight and tomorrow. And then uh, Sam uh, joined us this evening. And so three of us are in the stand. It's a beautiful November uh, afternoon, evening, slight breeze. Leaves are at their peak foliage and uh, hopefully the bucks are at their peak rut. So we'll see what happens. We've been sitting here about an hour now and it's been a beautiful afternoon, but no deer movement yet. But we're about to enter into this magic 40 minutes where the deer start to come alive. Well, folks, I just heard uh, Barrett shoot and he texted me that he shot at one and he said he heard it crash, so Let's go see what he got. What's up, guys? Uh, this is another episode of Party Farms, and just shot a nice eight-point buck, and right now we're going to go retrieve him. Awesome. Let's do it. Okay, folks, we found great blood. We're trailing this deer. Shine it right there. You can see it right there. This shit was on the floor. Nice buck. Shoot, that's a that's a ten pointer. Yeah. Great job. 
All right, guys, Barrett just recovered his nice uh, nine point buck here. How's it feel, man? It was great. Second buck. Um, it's an awesome night. He came in, started pushing does around, and pushed them off the field, and I decided to take him in. Awesome job, bud. Great work. Okay, guys, we're back here at the house. Proud of Barrett laying down a big nine pointer. Sam saw some does, about eight does tonight. And you know what? I didn't see a deer. And so that just goes to show you, you gotta be at the right place at the right time. And uh, this morning, Barrett didn't see uh, any deer and I saw a, a buck. So um, excited to be able to share the woods with these guys, always good to hunt around Thanksgiving. And this is uh, day two of our hunt. And we're going to get back after it tomorrow. So um, we'll catch back with you in the morning. Well, good morning and welcome back. This is... Uh, the final morning of our three-day hunt with my nephew Barrett. He was able to take a nice nine-pointer last night. We're over here hunting again in Alabama, near Piedmont, Alabama. And I've got uh, Mr. Calvin Booth with me, Pappy. And uh, he's hunting in a ground blind. I've got Barrett over in a ladder stand, and I'm up here in a blind as well. I just had a pretty decent seven pointer walk out in front of me and a spike. I was trying to get my camera set up. It's still early and uh, couldn't get a shot on them. But anyhow, we're, uh, it's a beautiful November morning, just a few days before Thanksgiving. It's good to share the woods with, with our family. And unfortunately, Sam is sick and Gray is on the way back from Montgomery, so we'll have to get them in the woods here when they when he starts feeling better and when Gray gets into town. So hopefully we'll have some deer movement this morning. We'll check back in with you here in just a bit. Folks, we got a doe. It's probably about 10 yards in front of us right now. She's been feeding for the last 20 minutes or so. Anyhow, the deer are starting to move. We're hoping for some larger deer. Okay, guys, uh, we're wrapping up our, uh, our hunt. We've been hunting over the last uh, few days together and uh, enjoyed the great outdoors this morning. It was beautiful. I think uh, Mr. Calvin saw some deer. Uh -huh. Saw maybe a spike, a six-pointer, some does. Yeah. Barrett was skunked this morning, <laughs> but that's okay. He killed a nice buck last night. I saw um, a pretty good seven-pointer early this morning and a spike, and then didn't see anything for, I don't know, about an hour and a half, and then had a doe come in. But anyhow, it's a great time. Uh, to be deer hunting and uh, always grateful to share it with these guys and uh, we'll uh, yeah get back after it soon we'll look forward to seeing you on another episode of party farms outdoors, outdoors. yeah <laughs>